little dumbbell. Have a great day at the plaza. Ah, thanks, mommy. Not on my watch, Foxmore. Unlocking another try? Yes. I was disappointed that your last attempt did not unlock my Paui Zowie. Me too. You're a tough kid to please. I have exacting standards. So, you got any ideas for other things to try? Yes. One of the things I'm trying to collect are microchips from Boxmore Robots. But they are obviously quite hard to come by. Why would you want those evil things? Technology is neither good nor evil, K.O. Those classifications only apply to what we use technology to achieve. In fact, it could be argued that good and evil are murky concepts with no universal definition. Nuh-uh! Boxmore is definitely evil! Okay, well, how would I get my hands on Boxmore microchips anyway? The Boxmore bots were programmed to have hubristic qualities. You brew what? They taunt and act like jerks, but there is a bug in the program. During a battle, if a Boxmore robot enters its taunting state, they are left vulnerable for a brief moment. If you hit them while they are taunting, it will initiate a behavioral override. The robots will malfunction, and then you can literally beat the microchips out of them. Whoa! And what do you do with them? Educational enrichment. Find a jerky box more bot and see if you can exploit this bug and get me their microchips. How does that one go?
can do this, KO! giving these to you, but here goes. Thanks, K.O. I promise I am not using them for evil. Hmm. Still not enough. Oh, man. Let's try unlocking it again tomorrow. Oh, by the way, you can always bring me box more microchips you collect in battle. And in return, I'll give you technos. Holy moly! Using evil robot microchips for good! As in, hopefully I can spend these technos and get some good POW cards. 
trying to figure something out. Are you and me best friends, or BFFs, or besties? Or maybe we're peerless pals, or bosom brohanskis? Or maybe you're my chummy from another mummy? Whoa, 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 K.O.! I didn't think we needed to put a label on what we have. But you're right, we definitely do! But choosing a friend level is not something I can take lightly. I have to protect the rad brand at all times, you get me? Sure, you're a brand, not a sentient being. And the brand has got to stay strong. That means any best friend or BFF or Bohansky of mine has got to be just as strong. If you want to hang with rad, you got to hang tough. What do you want me to do to prove I can add to the Radically's brand? A series of super dangerous tests of fighting skills, of course. Let's call them rad ickle feats. <laughs> That's good, yeah. I should trademark that. I shall make Radically's feet swell with pride. Okay, first feat. I call it Boxmore Cleanup Crew. You've probably seen those Boxmore boxes randomly around the plaza. Maybe you've even figured out that bots bring out ready to fight, like jerk in the boxes. But I doubt you've swept the whole plaza and fought every single one of them. Some days, I take on every random battle box in the whole plaza just for exercise. Pull that off and maybe I'll level you up to dear acquaintance status. I will earn a permanent place in your heart with savage combos. Time to fight for friendship.
First radical feat! Way to go, KO! It's good to know that a friend of mine can at least do the bare minimum of quality enemy brawling. If we were 
at the same party? I would definitely nod at you from across the room now, K.O. Wow! I randomly sent those Boxbow random battle boxes to sneak attack the plaza. And that pipsqueak K.O. just defeated all of them! That's so and so... Random? Alrighty. Press KO. Plaza! 